Hello there ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages, my name is Coaster Chal and welcome to Coaster Chal YouTube channel. <laughs> Hello there ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages, Coaster Chal here, Doncaster born but built for theme parks and welcome to a theme park newsroom update where, again, it's all change at Universal Studios Orlando. Fear Facts Alive, not just the show, but the venue as well, will be closed and demolished after Halloween Horror Nights this year. Now, before we get started with all the details surrounding this news, please like the video if you've loved it, comment down below your thoughts and opinions, subscribe if you are new around here, click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. We're getting closer and closer to 2,600 subs and three quarters of a million views. Let's get there as soon as possible, then we can focus on hitting the big targets, the 3,000 or 4,000 subs and the million view mark. So please, let's get there as soon as possible. Also guys, check the description down below for social media links and the Google Forms link where you behind the camera can submit your own video ideas for the channel. And for now guys, let's talk about the closure of Fear Factor Live at Universal Studios Orlando and what could be replacing it. So this article is from Theme Park uh, tri uh, Tribune, so shout out to them once again. Uh, now another stage show, Universal Orlando is closed for good. Orlando Park Stop was the first to report that Fear Factor Live will not be returning. While its closure has been rumoured for months and considering it hadn't reopened since the COVID-19 pandemic, it was widely expected the confirmation came from a private message from Universal on Twitter. However, it appears it's not just the show that's closing, it's the entire theatre. Yes, the Fear Factor Live venue will permanently close on Universal Studios Orlando on November the 1st, 2021. Alison Sologne Stoa, Universal Senior Director of Public Relations, told Theme Park Tribune in an email. The theatre is currently being used through the end of the month for the Halloween Nightmare Fuel Show and Halloween Horror Nights. It's been home to a stage production at the seasonal event since 2006, starting with the series of Bill and Ted Halloween Horror Night shows that ran up until 2017. While no replacement has been announced, Orlando Park Stop reports that the prevailing rumour is it will house a virtual reality Harry Potter attraction, serving as an expansion to the nearby Diagon Alley area. The fact that Universal specified the venue was closing not just the show lends credence to these rumours. Fear Factor Live originally opened back in 2005. It took over the space once occupied by the Wild 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 West Stunt Show, which ran from 1991 to 2003. This marks the third Universal Studios Florida attraction or show announced in 2021 to be closing. A Day in the Park with Barney was last performed in August 2020, but its permanent closure was only confirmed in February. Fear Factor Live will similarly not get any send-off. Universal also announced earlier this month that Shrek 4D would close for good on January 10th, 2022. So with the closure of Shrek 4D and A Day in Life of the Park with Barney and the refurbishment of Revenge of the Mummy and now the closure of Fear Factor Live, let me share my thoughts on the closure and also the rumoured replacement of a VR Harry Potter attraction to serve as an expansion to Diagon Alley. There we are, ladies and gentlemen, Thrill Six of All Ages. That is speaking about the closure permanently of Fear Factor Live at Universal Studios Orlando. Now, Fear Factor, I've watched numerous Fear Factor shows and I love that show so much, I cannot tell you. Um, but it is such a shame that the, uh, the show is coming to an end, finally. Um, I, know, I, know, I know quite a lot of people that, that, that did Fear Factor Live and um, was part of that show. And, you know, it, it's, it's such a shame. It really is a shame to see this attraction close, this show and entertainment show close, and the whole venue as well. Now, obviously, the speculation around this replacement is an interesting one, a virtual reality Harry Potter attraction. Uh, now, the rumor states that it was about flying on the, on the broomsticks, I believe, like, fly, like it was supposed to give you the sensation of flying on broomsticks. There's a rumor about 2023, maybe 2022. It could end up being 2024. We don't know for sure. Those are the three dates that I've heard the most, though. 2022, 2023, or 2024. It should be interesting to see when this opens. And it's in. I, I think this is a sign now. With um, with Hagrid's motor, motor, um, Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure and Velocicoaster both opening in the Islands of Adventure theme park over a two-three year period. 
I think the main Florida parks get in the getting the attention now. I think the the main Universal Studios Orlando um, Studio Park is getting the focus now with the closure of Shrek 4D, the refurbishment of Revenge of the Mummy, the closure of Fear Factor Live, the closure of Day in the Life with Barney. It, it, it's starting to get a bit more focus now, the studios part, now that Alan's Adventures had that two, three years of major investment. So I think the Universal Studios of Florida will be the next in line to get like a two, three year minimum period of, of investment, of new investment, major investment. So I think that, you know, with something new coming to Shrek 4D, with some, th with, with some new changes to Revenge of the Mummy, with something new coming to Fear Facts Alive, rumouredly, for the Diagon Alley expansion, I think that it will be a very much changed Universal Studios Orlando, a very different Universal Studios Orlando to what we knew previously. So uh, all in all, should be interesting, but again, very sad to see Fear Facts Alive close. It is a shame, and uh, may it rest in peace. But there we are, guys. Thank you very, very much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, my name is Coach Shell, Kitlin on the Coast of Life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a wonderful Fear Factor-tastic day.